Welcome to The Night Stand, the nightly talk show where we discuss managerial strategies with top business leaders and entrepreneurs that can help you go further and faster into business. I'm your host, Zach Rainville. Tonight, we have a very special guest, Blake Mikowski, who is the founder and head director of a shoe company you're probably very familiar with called Tom's. Tonight, Blake is going to discuss his influence on the current business scene and how his philanthropic work has turned into a multi-million dollar business. Please help me welcome him. Well, thank you for having me tonight, Zach. Oh, we're really excited to have you on our show. So off the bat, I'd really like to hear about your marketing and, and what sort of marketing strategies you use to get Tom's where it is today. I don't think we used any specific type of marketing. Mostly what we focused on was uh, what you, I guess you'd call cause marketing. We did start a for-profit business with a alternative incentive for the consumer, and that's really just to help those less fortunate than us. But uh, to date, our marketing strategy has really just been word of mouth or any type of social media platform. So talk to me a little bit about strategic alliances. Did any strategic alliances help you boost your brand's exposure? Well, strategic alliance is a very interesting word just through the fact that most alliances formed in these larger businesses do revolve around equity or some type of like mutually beneficial relationship. Right. And that's not something we've really developed with many people. There was, however, a constant debate through the hierarchy about some type of outsourcing or offshoring production just to make things more fluent. It's with those manufacturers that we have developed, I guess you could say, some type of strategic alliance with. But uh, by definition, I wouldn't say we've had any. Okay, so then focusing, I guess, more so internally, what do you really look for in, in your employees, in your partners? What sort of core values do you think drive your company? The driving force in our company being our mission and our motive. So finding people that can share that vision with me and finding people to run the day-to-day -day operations that I can influence and can trust to make decisions on my behalf has been difficult, but it is definitely doable. We've actually been looking for somebody to run the department head. That way I can try and see what's next for Tom's or for myself. And uh, it's taken some time, but we have found Jim Alling. He's doing a great job so far. So I'm excited to see what comes next for Tom's. And with that, we're gonna wrap things up tonight. Thank you again, Blake, for being our special guest and taking the time to answer some of our questions and really give us some insight on Tom's. Well, Zach, thanks for having me on the show. And to all those who tuned in with us tonight, don't forget to tune in tomorrow where we continue to discuss managerial insight that'll help you go further and faster with your business skills.